Hey friends, welcome to today's video. Today we are talking Ulta Beauty 21 Days of Beauty. I'm coming at you on Thursday, August 31st, and I have my little catalog here of all the goodies, all the daily deals. So we're gonna be focusing on the 50% off daily deals that they have running today and throughout the remainder of the promotion. So I took my time really going through this, going through my collection of products, what I already own and love, and I grabbed a good assortment of products here to share with you things that I've personally used over the years and love and recommend. So we are exclusively focusing on the 50% off daily deals, but head to ultabeauty.com because you can see all of the deals that you can get online and in store now through September 16th. I also wanna thank Ulta for partnering with me on this video and sponsoring this video. And I wanna thank you guys for supporting my channel and allowing really amazing opportunities like this I get to work with brands like Ulta. Let's go ahead and get started. I'm gonna go in order and we're gonna start with today, Thursday, August 31st, and we're gonna make our way through the remainder of the 20 21 days of beauty. I've got makeup, I've got skin, I've got, uh, yeah, I've got makeup and skin. <laughs> but there, you can also get deals on hair, on fragrance, pretty much on everything you can find at Ulta Beauty, different categories. I'm actually gonna use my little catalog here as a guide. So I stay organized and I stay on track. I've gone through each day and I've circled my recommendations. So today, August 31st, the Tarte Man Eater Glow Cheek Plump. Um, so I have two shades here. I have the shade Pink and I have the shade Buff. Today I'm wearing the shade Buff. What I love about this product is it's a really beautiful, buildable cheek color color. So it's a liquid cream blush. It's a very, I don't want to say sheer in pigment. You definitely see the product when you blend it out. It's not a sheer product, but it is a very versatile and blendable and buildable product. So it's super easy to work with and apply. If you are new to like a blush for me like this, this is a great one to start on because it's very difficult to mess it up. It also has a really beautiful, subtle, radiant glow built into this, but it's not shimmery. It almost reminds me of like silk sheets. You know, when you look at a silk sheets in the light, that reflection that you get in that sheen, that's the best way I would describe the glow on this, which is really great for those of us with texture on the skin, whether it's large pores, fine lines, whatever it might be, because products that have a lot of shimmer can typically magnify that. So it's difficult when you wanna glow, but you also wanna avoid products that have too much shimmer. This is a must have, it's a highly recommended product. Again, pink and buff, I'm wearing buff today and it's stunning. It's also nice because this is a product that you could pair with another blush. Like if you want a little more color or deeper color, you could top this on top of your favorite blush color. Absolutely beautiful, highly recommend. Okay, next up on Friday, September 1st, we have some really good deals happening on Friday, September 1st. I've circled two of them, and I also wanna mention the one that is a, like a cult classic favorite product, and I haven't really used this product enough to like rave about it as a personal favorite, but I wanna call it out because I know everyone loves this product, and that product is the Clarins Total Eye Lift Firming and Smoothing Cream. I hear so many great things about that, and I have that product, but I've used it here and there, so it's not a product that I can say like, oh my gosh, I love this product, but there are two on this list that I can say that to. So we'll talk about this first one. This is the OC Algae Body Butter, and this is actually a smaller size. I got this from like a travel set. I got this with a small body oil, and I travel with this product. Now it's a very, very rich, rich body butter. So I do wanna say that, because I know sometimes some people like a really rich body butter, some people like something a little bit thinner, not as thick, that's blendable, or easy to blend into the skin. I mix this, this is easy to blend into the skin, but it is very thick, so keep that in mind. The way that I love to use this product is I like to mix it with their body oil, and you certainly can use any body oil, you don't have to use the one, the same brand, but this is a 50% daily deal really nice formula, very luxe. It feels amazing on the skin, super hydrating. So if you have really dry skin, you will love, love, love this. Also wanna mention Lancome Big Monsieur Mascara is a daily deal on September 1st. And you know, I say whenever mascaras are part of these promotions, stock up because we go through mascaras, probably it's probably the quickest makeup product that we go through. So it's always a great idea to stock up on your favorite mascaras. I have many favorites from Lancome, we know that, but this one is one of my favorites. I have it on today. I would describe this as a very volumizing mascara. It does give length as well, but I just noticed like full volume at the root of the lash, and I get really dramatic lashes from this. So I really love this one. If you like dramatic lashes, if you have thin lashes, this is a great mascara for you. Okay, so moving along to Saturday, September 2nd, I have three products here in the catalog. I circled one of them, the Benefit Precisely Brow Pencil. 
pencil. Now I have a few bra pencil favorites, you guys know this. I was excited to see this one on here. I feel like Benefit is kind of the expert on brows. That Them and Anastasia Beverly Hills are really known for their brow products. I love the Gimme Brow Brow Gel, that's one of my favorites. Okay, so who is this really good for? This is the Precise Brow Pencil, hence the name. What that means is that the tip is gonna be very small and precise. I mean, really anyone can use this if you have really thick full brows but you have little bare spots, this would be great because you can just go and target those little bare spots. Now, if you don't have any brow or you don't have much brow at all and you really have to create a shape, this is also great because you can get hair-like strokes from it. I'm the shade three. It's got good pigmentation, meaning that, you know, you don't have to put a lot of pressure and you see the product applied to the skin. I love it. It also has a spoolie on the back like many of these do, but this is a really great brow pencil. I always pair brow pencils like this with brow gels and there is one that's part of the Ulta um, 21 Days of Beauty that we're gonna get to. It's on a later date. But with this, for my personal brows, I always need to pair it with a tinted brow gel because this will give me the shape, but I need to add volume with a brow gel. This is fun. I like this. This is so fun. <laughs> I love just talking about my favorite products. You know, it's just, it's, it's fun. I like sharing what I love about products. Okay, so moving on to September 3rd, Sunday. I have two products that I circled here. So we have the Too Faced Born This Way Concealer. This is a multi-use sculpting concealer, giant concealer. Get lots of product in this guy. I have the shade Nude. I have it on today and I actually topped it over a little bit of a, a sheer concealer that I had applied this morning. Full coverage, but very natural looking on the skin. It doesn't look heavy. It doesn't look cakey. Obviously the colors are gonna vary, but this particular color on me not only conceals, but it has some peach to it, so it cancels and brightens under the eye. This is a really great full coverage concealer. A little bit goes a long way. When you're working with full coverage concealers like this, whether they have a lot of coverage and pigmentation or they're just a thicker product and consistency, and I would say that this is, use about half of what you would use with another concealer. So sometimes the issue we run into with like a heavy or cakey looking concealer, it's not necessarily always the product. It might just be an over application. So that I would say that with this one is just be very minimal with it. You don't need a lot. Okay, now this was a new product that I actually picked up a couple of weeks ago when I found out I was gonna be working with Ulta because it sounded very intriguing to me and I can say it's now a favorite. So this is the All Nighter Urban Decay Waterproof Setting Powder. Waterproof jumped out at me. I feel like there's a big trend for waterproof products right now and why not? If you can put products on your face that you know can last through you know, an intense day, <laughs> whether you're jumping in the pool, getting sweaty, whatever it might be. If it's waterproof, you know it's gonna last a long time. So this is the Waterproof Setting Powder from uh, Urban Decay, the All Nighter. And I find that the All Nighter products really do what they say they're gonna do. They keep your makeup on all day, and this is no exception. This gives a very matte finish to the skin. So if you steer clear of very matte finishes, and this probably wouldn't be the powder for you, but if you like a really matte finish, it also, for me, I feel like it blurs and smooths out texture it's like blur like a pore blurring powder it's lightweight I actually expected this to feel a little bit heavier but when I applied it for the first time I was like oh this is really nice and lightweight I could keep this as a touch-up powder if I needed but I find when I use this powder I don't really need to touch up throughout the day so highly recommend this if you're oily skin pick this up Okay, you guys, let's jump over to Monday, September 4th. We have a few great deals here. We have three products here featured in the catalog. I circled two of them, and I was really excited about these two. So first up, let's talk about brow gels. I always wear brow gel. This is one of my favorites. This is from Grande Brow 2-in-1. It's a tinted brow gel and serum. So this does have the ingredients that the brow serum is gonna have. So if you struggle with brow growth, this can be a product that can, you know, just optimize the health of your brows. I know they're real careful about disclaimers and promises they make with lash and brow growth serums. So I wanna share that as well. It's a very conditioning product, so it's gonna help improve the health of your brows, which optimally, hopefully, will help with the growth of your brows. I have two shades. I have light and I have medium, and I actually use them both. It kinda of depends on the brow pencil that I use. So if I use a brow pencil that's a little too dark, or I feel like my brows are a little too strong, I will use the light to soften them. Today I use the light. If I'm using a brow pencil and I feel like it's too light or I didn't quite get the shape that I want, I'll go in with the 
medium. So I use them both, also depending on my hair color. Sometimes it's a little lighter, sometimes a little darker. I really love this brow gel. It's lightweight, it gives volume, it's holds in place. It's a good one, very good one. Okay, you guys, this is a newer product. This is actually the second one that I have. I have another shade that I got a few months ago. And so I picked this one up when I found out I was working with Ulta Beauty on this. I wanted to try another shade. This is the REM Rim Beauty. What are we saying? Are we saying REM or Rim Beauty? Rim Beauty. This is like their liquid shadows. Actually, the name of this is the Midnight Shadows Lustrous Liquid Eyeshadow. So it's a liquid eyeshadow. These are on sale for $8, you guys, $8. Um, I should probably give you the prices. Everything I'm sharing are the 50% off daily deals. So keep that in mind. Major, major sales. It doesn't get any more discounted than that. So why I love these. These are liquid shadows, which I'm all about. I'm all about liquid or cream shadows these days. Very pigmented, but nice and sheer. So when you're working with a liquid shadow, they can be great unless you apply a product that's a lot thicker or you apply too much. This one is pretty foolproof. I applied a lot today and I just blended it out. I used my finger to maybe absorb a little bit and it just applied a very even sheer application of product. This one's light enough, so I applied it from my lashes to my brows. This one was lighter than I thought it was gonna be, so I went over it with eyeshadow today, but the other shade that I have, I forget the name, but I will list it down below. It's more of a, like a beautiful taupe, matte taupe and that one I'll wear by itself. So these are really pretty by themselves, but they also work great under powder shadow so that it could work as like an eye primer. This one was light enough that I could take it all the way to my brow and it gave me a little bit of a brow highlight. I didn't apply a brow highlight under here. What you see right here is this shade. So these are great. If you like liquid, give these a try. You will really like them and they're $8. So pick up a couple. Okay, you guys, so we are jumping over to, we were, we ended up September 4th. There weren't any products the 5th, 6th, and 7th that were personal favorites of mine, but I do want to mention on the 7th, another product that is a favorite of many, and that's the Clarins Double Serum Eye Firming and Hydrating Concentrate. I just hear so many great things about Clarins products, so I wanted to share that. We are now on September. September 8th, and I did have a few I wanted to highlight here. So the Clinique Even Better Foundation. I really love Clinique's foundation lines. They are solid. I have a few of them that I love, and I feel like no one really talks about Clinique these days. This is really nice. It gives, I would say, about more of a, like a natural medium coverage. It's buildable. It looks very natural on the skin. I just love it. It's just a good, long-wearing, natural foundation. I love it. Next up, we have the Peter Thomas Roth Water Drench Hyaluronic Cloud Rich Barrier Moisturizer. So I wanna talk about that. I don't have it here with me, but I have used that product. Brooklyn loves that product. It's a really great lightweight gel moisturizer. So it's not for everybody. It's a gel moisturizer, which is kind of unique. It's really great for those of you who like lighter weight moisturizer feel on the skin. Maybe you use it in the morning when you're layering a bunch of makeup and you want your skin to feel very light. It's not a very like thick or rich formula. So if you prefer formulas like that, this wouldn't be one I would recommend. But I did want to say that this is a great lightweight gel moisturizer. I've used it. Brooklyn loves it. So that one is 50% off on September 8th as well. Okay, you guys, now we're jumping over to September 9th and the It CC Glow Nude um, CC Cream is on 50% off daily deals. It has an SPF of 40. I have the shade Light Medium. I love the It Cosmetics CC Creams. I remember, I can still vividly remember when I first tried the original CC Cream, the SPF of 50, like years and years ago. I was shocked because in my head, I always imagined that CC creams were lighter coverage and they offer exceptional coverage and high SPFs. So this is the version with a glow to the skin. So really great for dry skin, really great for those of you who like a glow. Um, you kind of knock it out in one product. A lot of great skincare ingredients here. So it's like a skincare foundation hybrid with SPF 40. I mean, you can't really go wrong. So pick this up if, that, if you fall into that category of people who love a glow, high SPF and skincare products. Okay, you guys, we are getting to the last page. I am jumping and skipping all the way to Wednesday, September 13th. I have this at home. I don't have it here. It is the Saint Tropez Self Tan Classic Bronzing Mousse. It is 50% off as everything is. It'll be $17 on the 13th. And this is really great for an instant dramatic bronze. Now I have a few bronzing products that I use, self tanners. I've always got self tanners. Right now I'm using the Isle of Paradise, like the daily gradual one. But if you haven't kept up with your self tan and you need one that day or the next day, this one is great. It's a mousse. Definitely use one of the gloves to apply it or you will end up with the not so cute self tanner hands, which I'm guilty of having sometimes. So that is one I would recommend to pick up. Moving on to September 14th, we have the Clinique Take the Day Off Balm. Really great 
balm to remove the day's makeup. It's great. I love a good cleansing balm on the days that I have a lot of glam on. And this one's a good one. I have a few others that I like, but this one's 50% off on the 14th. So I would recommend picking it up. Okay, you guys, and we're jumping to the very last day. This is September 16th. We got a couple of Kylie Cosmetics lip products, which I've tried. And I have to say she has really good lip products. So if you've been curious on the fence, it's a great time to pick it up. But I have highlighted the MAC Mineral Blush. It's so good. I've used this product for, I don't know, since they launched this product because I think I worked at Mac I think when they launched this product I think this product launched when I worked at Mac and I worked at Mac to 20 years ago a really great blush it's mineralized it's good, which means that it's going to give the skin a little bit of a glow kind of reminds me of like the powder version of these guys it's going to give that perfect subtle glow to the skin good pigment payoff not too much pigment but definitely you see pigment it's very easy to work with easy to blend they have a ton of really beautiful shades so check those out okay I feel like I've been talking a mile a minute in this video this video was fun I got a little excited about this. <laughs> Thank you for sticking through and watching it. I will have all of the products that I mentioned linked in the description box below. Thank you so much Ulta Beauty for partnering with me on this video. Thank you guys for watching it. Let me know what you're picking up at the 21 Days of Beauty. I'll let me know in the comments. Let's have a conversation and let me know your questions. I hope you guys have a beautiful day and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.